Hello guys, welcome. Welcome back on the technology belt here. Let's learn and watch with practical in this tutorial how to fix iTunes error. Sometimes as we know that if you would like to export and import any kind of the data from iPhones device to iTunes or iTunes to iPhones. In that condition your iTunes is not a proper or your iTunes is not being proper to functional in that condition. How do you fix it? Right now, see guys, if I click here, this device has been connected with a special iTunes, but there is a sign, but it's not a coming. It means, of course, there is a something, error or bug, and due to that, it's not going to a proper functional. Once again, if I open this one, see guys, it's a taking much more time, and thereupon, also it's not going to open a proper way, and if it is open, then, of course, it's not going to a proper functional. See, if I once again click to other as administrator, now see, still it's not going to open. And iPhone's device has been connected right now. See, guys, here, if I disconnect and once again if I connect, see, however, this iTunes is not going to open. Now, see, 3U tool has notified that your device has been uh, connected and it has just started to read all the information but what about the iTunes guys see still it's not open so how many times we will have to go for the Renage administration hmm? so that's why guys like if you would like to fix it quickly then of course there can be the 3U tool this is a uh, of course a mobile device management tool is specially designed for iPhones so right now here my motive to other fix it because uh, my motive to the fix iTunes especially. So how do you do that? Yeah, simply we will come on a especially M toolbox, toolbox two. Then we have to come in the utility, and uh, in a utility especially. Here we have uh, four options. One is a yes, more version of iTunes. Second is a uninstall iTunes, and third one is a repair drive driver as well as install the iTunes. So if you would like to repair then the old version will not be updated but if you go for install the iTunes and of course we will click here it will start to download. So it will take a scarcely 5 to 10 minutes to a download then of course you can go for install it. Yeah if you don't now see here it has started to install it now. See firstly it's asking that you would like to repair it or you would like to remove it. So, of course, I would like to remove it firstly. Or if you would like to save your data, then of course you can go with the repair option also. So, let's repair here. Yeah. Or if you would like to remove proper way, then no problem at all. You can remove it also. Internet speed is here. Uh, yeah. A little bit slow and so that's why having the time guys here but of course the whole procedure will take approximately 10 minutes so here we have two options uh, I have already mentioned to you here one is the repair second is for removing of this so if you would like to remove the, all the data will be removed and if you would like to repair then whatever the data will be uh, on the remain on that and then of course you can fix it so this is all about in this video tutorial. Furthermore, any inquiry, of course, blindly had a query below the comment box. The pleasure will be mine to reply to the query. Now see, it has started to the install of that. So thank you.